Hello everyone, uh, welcome to another video. Um, day two of me currently in my apartment due to the coronavirus which is going around in South Korea. Now just a quick update of what's happening at the moment. Uh, we currently have 893 people infected, uh, 9 people have passed away unfortunately and 22 people have cured. Now just, I know the media and news outlets can twist some things. I just want to read a few things out for you of what's actually going on and how many people are infected. So in the city of Daegu, 499 people are infected. In Gyeongbuk, 225. Now in Gyeonggi-do, there were 40 and that's the area that surrounds Seoul itself, the big large area that surrounds Seoul. Busan, the second city down south, 38 people. Seoul itself has 36. So as you can tell, further down the country is the issue with this coronavirus. The city of Seoul itself only has 36 cases. So it's very important for them to try and get this under control. Now, discussing a little bit more about yesterday, I was saying I don't know if I'm going to work for the rest of the week or not. The message I got this morning was, tomorrow I'm in the school, but there'll be no teaching. Um, it will be marking books, checking books, because as I said yesterday, this is the end of the year. Make sure all the books are okay, uh, marked and checked for them to, to go home to the families. That's what tomorrow will be, and setting up for the new year. So there'll be no teaching involved tomorrow. Uh, Thursday, I believe the parents are going to be in the school to pick up the books, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't think I'm going to be working. I think Wednesday is just sort of out for the year, then don't come in Thursday and Friday. Now, in regards to myself personally, uh, I'm fine. Um, spending a little bit bored, don't get me wrong. I spend my time playing a bit of PlayStation games, um, drinking a little bit of beer, and um, studying a bit of Korean as well uh, every day. Uh, I'm, I'm okay, I'm doing fine. Uh, I'm actually gonna make some Japaguri tonight. Um, if you've watched Parasite, if you've, you know, if you've lived under a rock, you've heard this movie called Parasite, I'm gonna make the spaghetti and uh, steak tonight that they made famous in that movie. So uh, I'm doing okay. I had a few friends over yesterday from the local area, nothing too um, brash, brash, nothing too big, just two or three people over. We had a few beers, listened to a bit of music because you've got to just take positives out of this negative situation. You've got to try and make the best of a bad situation, I believe. So as long as you're staying safe and not being stupid, running around, treating it like a vacation, then I think this situation is going to blow over, take the right precautions and we should be fine. So there's the update I've got for you right now. Now, if there's any big updates or escalations in numbers of infections, infected people over the next 24 hours, I'll update again. But for now, I feel like it's just the same news as yesterday, but just to let you know that it the, it's not the north of the Republic of Korea, it's down south that this issue is, unfortunately. The city of Daegu, unfortunately, has 500 people now infected, 499 people. So that city really, really is needing all the help it can get at this moment in time. So uh, everyone's in Korea, stay safe. As I said before, please, if you come into Korea, don't let it put you off. The government is doing its best to try and resolve this situation as quick as possible. We are all working together and as long as people can follow the right precautions, we should be fine. So any comments, concerns, shoot away. A few people have been messaging me. Thank you very much. Thank you for your concerns. A lot of people are telling me to stay safe. Thank you very much for that. Uh, and yourselves, please stay safe. Don't let it put you off coming to this country. Okay, see you later.